Hello and welcome to the Chemical Industries Association News. I'm Angela Lamont. If you were asked to name one of the UK's greenest industries, you might not immediately think of the chemical industry. But a report of independent data shows that for every tonne of carbon used to produce chemical products, at least two tonnes are saved over their lifetime. Now, that sounds like an impossible trick. But according to McKinsey's, who wrote the report, products like insulation save up to 2,400 million tonnes of carbon. That's 243 times more than the emissions from making them. Another 700,000 tonnes of carbon are saved because of the technology the industry supplies for fluorescent light bulbs. The industry has also worked hard to improve its emissions by 35% compared to 1990 levels, something many sectors won't reach until 2020. As governments across the world prepare for the United Nations Framework Convention on Climate Change in Durban, the chemical industry says it can double its carbon saving potential with the right global agreement in place. At the launch of the report, Steve Elliott, Chief Executive of the Chemical Industries Association, stressed the dangers of the UK moving the cost of its climate change policies ahead of other countries. As the industry exports most of its products, contributing £30 million a day to the UK's balance of payments, it's essential that the industry is able to compete in a global marketplace. Instead, incentives to invest in innovative new products would help the UK lead the world in new technology and advance green manufacturing. Advanced materials will help us reduce emissions from aeroplanes by making them lighter or increasing energy efficiency. For instance, platinum isn't just for wedding rings. One company is working on electroplating engines with it to enable them to be run at higher, more fuel-efficient temperatures. Fuel cells and nanomaterials also have a great potential to produce solutions to carbon emissions. So, next time you think about chemicals, you'll be thinking green. Until the next time, from me, Angela Lamont, goodbye.